you like how these sunglasses give me a unibrow? Hey girl, is that the Milky Way on your shirt? Because I'd like to see my Milky Way all over you. Bum, 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 bum. I have a specific message for all of those graduating seniors talking about you college graduates. I myself once graduated from college, therefore I think that I'm pretty much an expert on life post-college. So I'm going to go ahead and just share some of my wisdom and experience and advice with all of you who are about to enter the real world as adults for the first time. First of all, what the fuck does any of that even mean? I'm sorry, where have you been for the past 21 years? Have you not been in the real world? Have you been in some kind of fake world? Have you been living in an alternate universe? In some ways, you sort of have been. You've been fed this idea. They tell you, K through 12 and three or four years for undergrad, you are going to be adequately prepared to enter the real world, adult life. You hear this commencement speech and the speaker's like, you have the world at your fingertips, you have done all of the work required of you, and now you are ready to go forth and attack. And you're like, yeah, I am amazing. I'm gonna change the world. And you are, but not right now. You are not prepared. Not just you. None of you. Formal education does not adequately prepare you for what it's like to pay rent, buy groceries, try and deal with adult relationships, work a job that you're probably not gonna like that much. You're about to enter your freshman year of real world existence and it's gonna slap you across the face with its giant It's gonna leave a mark. We've been lied to our whole lives. You can write a 20 page paper in MLA format with like a bibliography and like cite all your sources and like you had an A on it. Oh my god. The real world doesn't give a shit about that. I don't want to downplay graduating from college. It's a big deal. But graduating from college is not the hardest thing I've ever done. The hardest thing I've ever done is survive the years post graduating from college where I was basically like twiddling my thumbs for hours being like, what the fuck am I doing with myself? Nobody told me it would be like this. Nobody told me it would be like this. That's why I'm telling you. Do you know what I would give to write a 15 page paper instead of having to pay my rent every month? My left teat, okay? If you were anything like me, you grew up in a house where there was always toilet paper in a closet and when you ran out of toilet paper you could just go grab another roll or there were always bananas on the counter and you could just eat a banana on your way out the door or there was always milk in the fridge that wasn't old it wasn't until I graduated from college that I realized those things don't just exist those things take effort to buy and have and to replenish when there are no more of them this sounds basic but this is the adult experience this is growing up growing up is remembering to buy toilet paper. Growing up is making sure that your milk doesn't go bad. I've had milk in my fridge for months before I noticed that it was bad. Does this bed look like it's made? Does this bed look like the bed of an adult? Does this bed look like of someone that graduated from college? No, and this is my life. You're probably thinking, oh my god, my whole life is ahead of me. I'm a little bit overwhelmed by it. Let's just read it in a little bit. Let's just focus me really small. What can you focus on right now so that you can make a healthy and easy transition? Number one, you need to accept that you are not prepared. Stop feeling sorry for yourself that the economy is bad or that you have student loans to pay or that someone isn't moving in with you who said that they would or that like your parents are cutting you off. Whatever it might be, just accept that you are not prepared because nobody is prepared. Even your parents, even Obama, even Oprah, none of them. We're all just like free balling, free wheeling, hanging out, playing by ear, trying to survive. And the worst part is that you're supposed to feel really great and excited and you're supposed to be like, oh my God, I'm graduating from college. And that's how like everybody acts and everybody looks on graduation day. But truthfully, everyone is kind of pissing their caps and gowns because it's scary leaving the nest. I just wish when I graduated from college that someone had told me 
it's gonna be really really hard but you're gonna be okay this video is so effing self-help it makes me want to puke you're gonna be fine you're gonna be fine I feel really good that we talked like this and I hope you do too see ya gross